Hi there. More workouts are focusing on increasing flexibility and agility as well as building strength. One versatile piece of equipment is making it easier to incorporate all three. Corey Galusha from Ultimate Results Mobile Personal Training shows us how to use a Viper tube to get the maximum benefits. Take it away, guys. All right, thank you very much for having us back again. I really appreciate it. Today, what I brought was the Viper. That's V I P R. And what the V I stands for is vitality, the P stands for performance, and the R stands for reconditioning. So, really, you're only limited to your imagination and creativity with this uh, piece of equipment. It is one of the best pieces of equipment for functional training out there. Um, Priscilla is going to be one of my uh, demonstrators, going to be my demonstrator. She's one of my favorite clients right now. She's kicking some butt. So, we're going to go ahead and start off with thread the needle. So, thread the needle, you're going to have these little handles that you go ahead and grab it. She's gonna go into a perfect squat. Knees aren't coming out past the toes. She's keeping her back flat and she's keeping the tube out in front of her, especially when she rotates. Keeping the tube out in front of her like that forces more core stabilization. And as she speeds up, it's really gonna get the heart rate going and your legs are actually gonna burn out pretty quickly. Now we're gonna go ahead and add a little movement to it. So we're gonna do thread the needle and then drive and punch. So she's gonna go into that squat and then she's gonna come up opposite foot. So this is one we are practicing backstage a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and go into the thread the needle and then you're going to come up and shoot that bazooka. There you go. Now she's got it right. There we go. Thread the needle and she's going to come up almost like she's punching with that right hand. She's going to step forward with the opposite foot. This is a phenomenal piece of uh, uh, exercise to go ahead and fire the whole body, whole body exercise. Okay, now we're going to go into side lunge and rotation. She's going to grab the outside of the tube as you can see right there. Now she's going to go into a side lunge, reach way out to that left side and then bring that right arm out and then up. What this fires is a lot of stabilization right through that lat, right through her core. She's getting the leg. It's a full body exercise, full body exercise. You go to one side and then you actually go to the other side. The next one we're actually gonna do is the rainbow. So you're gonna go ahead, bring your hands back to the handles. There you go. Now she's gonna go into a squat on one side, bring it up over the head and squat on the other side. Letting the arms cross in front. She's firing the legs, the lat, the core stabilizers and working the shoulders as well. This is a phenomenal exercise, and like I said, you're actually limited to just your creativity and imagination with this. Next, we're gonna go ahead and do is this lunge and with rotation. So I'll do this one with her. We're gonna put this on the right side. We're gonna step forward with our left foot and swing up like we're punching with our right hand. So we're gonna step forward with that left foot and come up and across. Coming back and load it up again. What this is really firing is the whole, the leg that you're stepping out with, with that left side, you're gonna fire that glute, hamstring, and quad, and with the shoulders and arms and core, everything is working. This is a full body exercise, phenomenal for everything. Now, we got another one. This one is gonna be, we're gonna go into a step into a lunge, we're gonna swoop down and into a press, okay? So we're gonna step forward with that right foot, swoop down, coming all the way up into a press right back to the uh, center. Going down and coming up. Now, go ahead, that's good. This is one of the best pieces of equipment. Um, it was actually designed for farmers. For farmers? What are you talking about? It was inspired by farmers, okay. I should say. So you know how farm boys are really stocky, really, really built, and they usually <laughs> have the job. best sports. You know, they usually have a, a little bit more uh, sports performance. They're the big guys in the football mm -hmm. teams, on the wrestling teams. Well, using this, very much similar to picking up a hay barrel, putting it up here. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. it's very, it's using Full all. Body. Exactly. Now, you talk about core stability, and people hear that term a lot, but one of the things that you concentrate on is functional strength, which means that if we do this, we're going to be more functional in our everyday lives. Everything we're doing gets exactly. better from, from working out this way, right? Correct, yes. So this thing is pretty cool. It's a little bit more than $100. So if somebody can't afford that, is there kind of a substitute we could use? Sandbags are a great substitute. Also, I've had clients just use a long cylinder type of thing where it could be like an umbrella. It could be even a, a dowel or a, a broom handle. Mm -hmm. It's not going to necessarily give you the, a lot of resistance, but it's at least is going to teach you the form and technique um, and using your body in, a, in, in ranges of motion, what I call 3D training, all planes of motion. We're using the transverse, using the, uh, the uh, frontal and the sagittal planes. What does of, that mean? So the frontal is, you got right here, sagittal yep. is going to be up in front, and then transverse is rotation. Round and round. Okay. Yes. So how, how long does it take to get maximum benefits out of this? Maximum, how long are the workouts? The workouts could be about anywhere between 20 and 45 minutes. Um, but using this, I had a client actually see me out in the lobby, and she, a former <laughs> client, and she's like, oh, you're bringing, bringing the Vipers. Oh, she's like, I hate those. Um, so people either love or hate these things because it, it's de deceptive or uh, a little confusing. It doesn't it, look like it's it going to be It doesn't look like work. it's going to be as hard as it is. And as always, we want people to check with their doctor. 
doctors because it's right. not for everybody, right? right? Depending on on what kind of physical condition you're in, or if you have an injury, that kind of thing. Knees and backs, you kind of want to go really light with this. And as you can see, we have different different sizes. So you want to check with your doctor if you have any physical limitations, and make sure you get the clearance first, um, and find out what ranges of motion that or you're limited to. Perfect. I love seeing that. That looks great. Thank you. We'll be right back with Cisco Morris and a closer look at the lovely Larkspur. He'll be right back.